evolution of Natya, mythology. Towards the end of Treta Yuga, there was a lot of misery and suffering as people had started disobeying the laws of nature. People were selfish, greedy and power crazy. The Devas went to Lord Brahma, the creator, and requested him to create an art form which would remind the people about Dharma. Brahma went into deep meditation, recollecting the four Vedas and created the fifth Veda called Natya Veda in order to uplift the people. He took the text from the Rig Veda, music from the Sama Veda, Abhinaya or expression from the Yajur Veda and Rasa from the Atharva Veda. Did you know the names of the four Yugas are Satya Yuga or Krita Yuga, Treta Yuga, Dwapara Yuga and Kali Yuga. We are now believed to be in the Kali Yuga. Brahma taught Natya Veda to Bharata Muni and he in turn taught it to his hundred sons or disciples. On Bharata's request, Brahma created 24 apsaras, nymphs, to learn and perform the Kaishiki Vritti, which comprised graceful movements. During the festival of Indra Dvaja, Bharata Muni staged a drama called Amrita Manthanam. The Asuras, on seeing their defeat depicted in the performance, were offended and started disturbing the drama. Indra warded off the evil with his Jarjara and Vishwakarman was ordered to build an auditorium for performing Natya and the gods were assigned to protect the actors and audience from the forces of evil. Did you know which avatara did Vishnu take during the Amrita Manthanam? It is Kurmavatara. Bharata Muni then performed a drama called Tripura Dahanam in front of Lord Shiva. Shiva was very impressed and he recollected his own dance. He requested his attendant Tandu to teach it to the hundred sons of Bharata. As his dance was taught by Tandu, it came to be called Tandavan Ritta. Lasya, the graceful aspect of Shiva's dance, was taught by Parvati to the world. Usha, the daughter of Barnasura, was a great devotee of Parvati. Pleased with her devotion, Parvati taught the Lasya aspect to Usha. Usha in turn taught all her friends in Dwaraka. This is how dance is believed to have come to this mortal world. Social Evolution History has shown that dance was always part of the human desire to express our deepest feelings. Early dance movements slowly became structured and evolved into folk dances which in turn crystallized into the classical dances that we know today. Did you know, even before language evolved, hunters are believed to have come back to their settlements and enacted their hunting episodes to their tribes. This can be considered to be the origin of drama.